Good evening. Can you hear me? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good How are evening. you? How are you today? It's fine. That is good. How was your weekend? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How was your weekend? What did you do? It was very good, teacher. Was good. Okay. Did you did you go out? Yes. Uh, last Sunday, I go out because I was visiting my family, uh, my parents. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Let me see. Okay, we are waiting. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, everyone. Okay, let me see. Let me share my screen. Okay, I guess you already uh, can see it, right? Ven mi pantalla? Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, Gilberto, Liliana, uh, Hazel, Carlos. Well, Carlos says that we'll be just listening today. Mauricio, Robert, Katy, Lady, Daniela. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, let me see. Let me let me continue. Today is July twenty fourth. This is the class fifteen. Okay. Uh this week and Monday, okay, and we are done with this uh model. Okay, today we're going to continue reviewing questions with B in the past tense, okay, and at the end we have a practice conversation. The main lesson objective for this class will be to describe your last weekend, okay? At the end we're going to have a conversation uh, to describe, that will be in pairs, to describe what did you do last weekend, okay? <clears throat> Okay, let me see. I have questions regarding to was and where. Was and where questions. Okay, raise your hands if you want to participate. Carlos, okay, Roberto Carlos, Mauricio, who else? Okay, Robert, you will be the first one, okay? Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let me, let me start again. Okay, was it the same? Okay, was it hot yesterday in your place where you live? Yes, yes. Yesterday was was is very hot because um, the weather is very sunny all day. All For that day. reason, in my in my house it was very uh, very hot. Okay, I understand. I guess in every in every um, I mean in all the country, right? In every place where you live, that it is uh in that way. So, because of yesterday I was in La Libertad, you know, there, right, it's, 
is uh, as normal, right? That is hot. That the temperature is always like that. But in another places, it was the same. Okay, let me see. Uh, Mauricio. Uh -huh. yeah, um, three years ago, I I had a uh, experience. I I went to United States in Phoenix, Arizona, and this state is very hot because mm -hmm. the temperature um is it was um uh, one hundred ten Fahrenheit. It's okay. very hot. Okay. Yes. Imagine. Yeah. Okay, for how long did you go? Just for for a couple of days? Yeah, a couple of days. Uh, only for for vacation, I was visiting my my parent and my brother in the United States. Okay, good. Okay, thank you so much for that information, Robert. Okay, was the last test difficult, Mauricio? Did you complete the last test, the major exam? Do you consider that was difficult? Uh, okay, uh, sorry, teacher, but I didn't complete the last test. Okay, so, but so it... I was uh, I was working my my on my weekend. Okay, so remember that you need to complete that. Okay, because <laughs> in order to in order to to pass this model, you need to have all the scores. Okay. Yes. So, yes. and that is for everybody. If you haven't completed yet, if you haven't completed uh, the last test in homework that you have for the previous sections, please do it because it is really important that you do that. Okay. You already know how um how is the dynamic if you want to pass the module so you need to complete all the evaluations okay good okay. lady were you home last night puede repetirlo por favor <laughs> Yes, can you see my screen? Sí, puede ver mi pantalla. Sí, solo okay. que no me había pasado, estaba la misma, ahora sí. Oh, okay. Were you home mm -hmm. last night? No. No? Where no. where were you? <laughs> <laughs> eh, um... En, ¿Cómo podría decirlo? ¿Dónde me quedo para cuando voy a trabajar? Oh, ok. So, it is, it is a place where you usually uh, stay for your, um, for your job, right? Ok, so it means that yes. you, have, you have to travel uh for your work just stay in in a different place the i mean the the weekdays and on weekends you go to your home or mm -hmm. how okay yes okay good let me see uh Gilberto, you will be next okay where we at a school yesterday? Okay, I'm going to change that. Uh, where we studying or English yesterday? Uh, yes, I was. Uh, we uh, you is uh, you were school yesterday. yesterday. We were, yes, we were uh, at school yesterday. Yes. Yes. 
Okay. Uh, where no. were it was? Yes, we were. Yes, we were. Okay. Yes, if you we want, were. if you want to answer that, if you want to give just a positive answer, yes, it's correct. If you want to give a negative answer, how will be? All right. How will be the negative answer for that question? Uh, no, we wasn't. No, we were, were not. No, we were, were not. not. Mm -hmm. No, uh -huh. no okay. we were not. Okay. Or no, we, we were not. Okay. Uh, Rolando, you will be next. Mm -hmm. Were you tired last night? Yes, I weren't, teacher. Uh, last night is a uh, so tired, teacher. Did is you... the the uh, in my job is terrible. Is it's very hard, teacher. Okay. Did you work yesterday? Yes, I I worked yesterday, teacher. Okay, good. I understand and I'm really sorry about that because you worked on Sundays. Okay, uh, William Roque, are you available? No? Okay, Liliana, are you available? No? Wilber Francisco, are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay, you will be next, Wilber. Were you okay, in teacher. were you in Canada last year? Mm, no, I was teacher. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Okay. Okay. Is correct? Uh, correct. No, I wasn't. Okay. No, I wasn't. Okay. Uh next will be for Hazel. Hey Hazel, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, that will be your question. Uh where were your classmate at la at the library yesterday? No, they are not. No, mm -hmm. we were not. Okay. okay, good. Daniela, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay. Daniela, you will be next. Okay. Mm -hmm. Were you at work yesterday? Yes, I I was at work yesterday. Okay, Correct. yes, yes, I was at work yesterday. Okay, very good, good answer. <laughs> Mauricio, are you there, Mauricio? Yes, yes, I'm here, teacher. Okay, you are next. Okay. Was yesterday Sunday? Was yesterday Sunday? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Yesterday was Sunday. Yes, it was. Yes, yeah, it was. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Kathy, are you there? Yes. Okay. Was the teacher late for class today? <laughs> uh huh. What will be your answer? No. 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 She was not. She wasn't. No, she was not. Okay. No, good. She was not. 
Okay. Okay. This is the way that, that we create questions, right? In past tense. So as you can see, using where, 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 okay, was, okay, where and was. You talking about past tense, okay? Very good. Thank you so much for your participation here. Okay, next. Um, how often do you evaluate products at your company? This is one question that I have for you and the place where you work. So if you work um, with products, how often do you evaluate products at your company? Who is in charge of buying supplies at your workplace? So the supplies are the ones that you use, okay, to produce what you are doing. For example, if you are, if you, uh, if your the products that you produce in your company is clothes, right, es ropa. So who buy the supplies to produce that? Okay, who wants to answer this question? Someone? If that is part of your job, evaluate products. No, teacher. No. Uh, in my case, I just work with uh, services. Services. We sell services uh, because we are a bank, so we, we don't have to a line of production. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Hazel. Someone teacher. else? Uh -huh, Robert? In my case, uh... In my company, in my company, there are a department for purchasing, and when the department buy to the products, mm -hmm. department of quality is the responsible to evaluate the products. In my case, I am a a quality control, and I am check, I am checking the the products uh, for your quality. Okay, you evaluate the products, right? Yeah. How often do yeah, you do I, that? I always, always, all all invoice, all invoice, I check in the products. If if one product is no is not comfort the quality, uh, we we not accept the product. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, it's part of the of your job, right? Okay, yes. just just try to uh double check the pronunciation of purchase. 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 Okay. Purchase. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much, Robert. Someone else who wants Me, Okay, Julio. Hello. Yes. Okay. Uh, every time we make a purchase, um, in my company, um, uh, let me see who is the in charge of buying. Uh, in my company, uh, my boss is in charge of buying. I ask this, uh, with the purchase to my boss. Okay. Good. That is part of your job, right? Okay, thank you so much. Uh, okay, let me see the chat. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. In my case, uh, my boss uh, buy buying the product, the company. Mm hmm. Your uh, boss buy everything for your yes. company. Okay. Yes. Okay. So they are the one that is in charge. 
Okay, in charge es el encargado. Okay. Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, very good. So we have here a conversation. Let me read it for you. It says, "Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part of this sewing machine?" Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Okay, I need the evaluation of the product, of the new product. That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order Did you order it online or did you buy it downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself, downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. Okay. Do you have questions about the uh, vocabulary in this conversation between er Hank and Eric? No? Do you know everything? Okay, good. Uh, Okay, who wants to participate? I need two volunteers. Me. Okay, Mauricio, Lady, <clears throat> Hazel, Julio, Gilberto. Okay, <clears throat> Robert, Daniela. Okay, <clears throat> we'll be uh, Julio and Lady first. Okay, Lady. ¿Qué persona Hi. Um, okay, go ahead, go ahead. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part of the sewing machine? Uh, yes, I did, Robert. Uh, the price was uh, $78. Okay, I need the evalu evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. Yeah, it will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order did you order online or did you buy if downtown? Yes, I went go get it get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. Thank you, lady. Thank you, Julio. Okay, very good. Good job. Thank you so much. Okay. Um just let me see. Sewing. Okay, just the this one. I'm sorry. That is so like a oh oh here. Sewing machine, okay. Sewing. Okay. Good. Uh let me see, Julian Lady, and then Mauricio and Hazel. Go ahead. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hi Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was seventy-eight. Okay, I need the evaluation for the pro of the product. Of the new product. That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order order it online or did you buy it in downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. Thanks. Thank you. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, now Gilberto and Daniela. Okay. Empiezo, Daniela. Okay, empiezo. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was 
78 okay okay i need the evaluation of the product of the new product that rice it will be ready tomorrow great did you order it online or did you buy it downtown yes i went to get it by myself downtown oh was the customer serving it was nice as usual thank okay. you Daniela. thank you so much okay sewing repeat that hilberto sewing 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 machine sewing machine Repeat it. Sewing machine. Okay. Thank you so much. $78. Daniela. Okay. $78. Yes. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. I have Robert. Who else wants to participate with Robert? Someone else? Someone who wants to participate with Robert? Me, Rolando. Oh, who said me? Hi, Salvador. Okay, Salvador. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Okay. I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online? Or did you buy in downtown? Yes. I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. Okay. Yeah, Salvador. Okay, very good. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you so much, guys, for your participation here. Okay. Um, what did Eric need to buy? What did Eric need to buy? According to the conversation. Mm -hmm. The spare part. Mm -hmm. The, the spare is part, part of the sewing machine, right? That was the product. Okay. Was... What was the price of the product? Do you remember the price? $78. $78. dollars $78. Okay. How was the customer service at the store? It's very nice. Was very nice. Was really good. Okay. Very good. Okay. As we remember... We have been studying the past of verb B, okay? So now we are going to continue working on it, uh, creating or um, writing, practicing questions, okay? We have the structure here, that is B, okay? The, that is auxiliary B, it could be was or where, plus subject, Okay, the subject, in this case, the training, all the employees, <clears throat> plus complement. In this, in this case, the complement is interesting and at the conference. Okay, if we read the complete uh, equation, it will be, was the training interesting? Were all the employees at the conference? Okay, questions, answers, uh, yes, it was, no, it wasn't. Yes, they were. No, they weren't. Okay. 
just no questions. Okay, good. Um, I consider that is very easy the 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 structure of the questions. Okay, remember first is the auxiliary verb be, then is the subject. Okay, and then the complement. Just you need to make sure you need to you need to make sure if the question that you are creating, um, is is with the verb be or with the verb do, okay? Because there are different kind of questions. It depends on the scenario. It depends on the context that are the, the um, type of question that we are going to use, okay? Okay, do you have doubt? Do you have questions about this? Just let me know. The teacher. Yes. Uh, um, in the second sentence, structure B plus subject plus complement. Mm -hmm. But is the past tense of the verb B? Correct. Uh, okay. Yeah, the past tense was and where. Remember that in the in in um present tense we have for I. We have am um, for third person singular that is she, he, it. We have uh, is, right? And for third person plural that is they, you, um, we, that is are, right? And now, for in this case, pass of B, okay, past tense, okay, for I, she, he, it, we have was, okay, and then the rest, they, we, you, we have where, okay? Okay, if you have questions uh, during the process, please let me know, okay? Here we have some um, short paragraph. It says, read the following services, okay? And write questions to evaluate them using simple past and past of B. Then ask questions to a classmate, okay? For example, we have here, on November 1st, uh -huh, I bought, compre, okay, the, the, here is the past tense, a spare part of, for the printer at spare ES, okay? The price was $300. The brand was Breedwell. The customer service was great because we received all the information we needed. Okay, if we use here this information to create questions, okay? When did you buy this per part? Okay, okay, when did you buy? So there we are going to use the bird or the auxiliary did. That will be the past, right? Because we are asking where or when, I'm sorry, when. And the answer will be on November 1st, right? Okay. Uh, and then to ask the price, how you are going to create the question to ask the price? Do you remember the, the, the equation? How much is the part? Mm hmm what was okay remember that you you are using past tense if you said how much is you are using simple present so in this case okay. you're going to use past what was the price okay what was the price of the product 
And the price was? 78 dollars. No, in this case, the, the information. 300 dollars. 300 dollars, okay. Okay, if we are... If we ask the question about the brand, how are we going to create the question? What was the brand or the part? Uh -huh. What was the brand? Okay, very good. Okay, if we ask the question about how was the customer service, uh -huh, how will be the question? Uh-huh. I already did I already tell you how was the customer service, right? How was the customer service? Using the verb be, okay? And WH question. In this case, we are asking uh information, okay? Okay, and the second says on January the second, I bought the read part that were requested. The price was $30 each. And they were installed in the sewing machine. The machine was working properly. Okay. Okay, I will give you from three to five minutes to create. Let me see. One, two, three, four questions about this. And then I will ask you. Four questions about this information that you have here that we can answer with that information the second mm -hmm. the second okay When you are ready, please let me know. Okay, let me take uh, the attendance before you participate. Okay, Carlos is still here. Carlos Ernesto. Lo vi que estaba de oyente, pero ya no lo veo. Carla, Silvia, Liliana. Oh, yes, he is here. Okay, Carlos Arsenio. Okay, Cindy. Present teacher. Okay. Daniela. Present teacher. 
Okay. Gilberto. Present. Hazel. Juliana. Juliana, are you there? Hello. Juliana. Hazel. Hazel. Present. Okay. Jose Andres. Jose Andres. No yet. No ha venido todavía. Okay. Uh, Julio Aristides. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Carla y Dari. Carla. Okay, Kathy Briseida. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Kathy. Lady. Present. Okay, Liliana. Present teacher, good evening. Good evening. Maria Leticia. Present teacher. Thank you, Maria Leticia. Mauricio de Jesus. I'm here, teacher. Okay, Roberto Carlos. Present, teacher. Thank you. Danilo Alberto. Danilo. Sorry, teacher. Usted dijo a Danilo Alberto. <laughs> o oh, no soy yo. <laughs> Perdón. Es Rolando. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Ok. Eh, es Present, que le, Leo, Leo, Danilo está arriba y Alberto está abajo. Leo. Danilo. Ah, ok. Y se te confuse, teacher. I get confused, yes. Ok. Um, Salvador, Alberto. Present, teacher. Ok. Um, Silvia Estela. Okay, uh, Wilber Francisco. Present teacher. William. William Roque. Okay, this is missing Carla Ifari and Jose Andres. <clears throat> okay, good. Who is ready? Please raise your hands. Okay. Okay, Robert, tell me what will, what will be the questions that you have for the second paragraph? Okay, teacher, I have I have three three questions. Number one, mm -hmm. when was the purchase date? When was the purchase date? Okay. What well, is the answer? The answer is it was on January 2nd. January 2nd. Okay, good. Number two, what was the price of the par? Mm -hmm. the answer? It, it was $300. It was mm, $30. Because we are speaking about the second one. Oh, $30. Okay. Yes, it's $30. $30 is okay. correct. Okay. Uh -huh. And number three, how was the sewing machine working? Mm -hmm. The machine working, the machine was working properly. Properly. Okay. Properly. Very good. Good good questions and answers, Robert. Thank you. Someone else? Lady, uh huh. Yes. Um, what was the price they installed in the sewing machine? 
What was the price of? Install in the sewing machine. Mm, or what was the the price of the read parts of the sewing machine? Oh. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. What is the second one? Uh, how how was working the machine? How was working the machine? Okay. What is the answer? Uh, properly. It was working properly. It it okay. was it was working properly working properly yes what else um, do you have como dijo what else ¿Qué más? Ah, when both the read parts when did when you deal? when did you buy okay when and Bye. Yes. El verbo comprar uh -huh. lo usamos en, en tiempo normal porque el auxiliar es did. Ahí ya, se, uh -huh. ya hacemos énfasis que estamos hablando del pasado. When did you buy uh -huh, the read part? When did you the read part? Uh -huh. What is the answer? Uh, okay. Uh, on January 2nd. On January 2nd. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Teacher, y yes. había hecho otra, pero quería como, por ejemplo, para preguntar quién sería who. Who? Mm, uh -huh. Para preguntar quién lo compró. ¿Cómo iría? Who did you... No, 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 no. Who did... Mm -hmm. Who did uh, buy? Who did buy the red parts? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Who else? Who else? ¿Quién más? Mauricio, do you have your raise? Uh, la tiene levant your your hand raised because you want to give answers. You you want to give us your questions, or because you okay, forgot? Teacher. Okay, oh. okay, I will okay. I will try. Okay. Uh, uh, when did you buy the Ritz part? Mm -hmm. When did you buy? The answer, yeah, when did you buy the read parts? Uh, the answer is on January 2 or January 2nd? January 2nd. Okay, January 2nd. Uh, what was the price? Mm -hmm. It was $30. Okay. What where else? did you, where he, oh, sorry where uh, was working how was working the machine okay how was working the machine and it was it was working properly okay very good okay that's all yes very good okay thank you so much someone else me teacher okay Gilberto. when was by spare part for the printer when was was by Spar par for the printer. In this case, is when did you buy? Mm 
when did you buy, okay? Because you, if you said when was by, Mm -hmm. When was by spar spar for the printer printer. Okay, we are using another tense. If you use um, if you use where, where where. Okay, entonces estaríamos hablando de las partes en plural. Okay. ¿Cuál sería el past participle of by? Both. 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 Okay. both. Where, 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 both. ¿Dónde fue comprado? Okay. Where, where, both. The, the rich part requests. The rich part, ajá. Uh -huh. Pero aquí estamos utilizando otro tiempo, ya, yeah, ¿ok? Que no lo estamos viendo todavía, eso lo vamos a ver más, más adelante. Pero para hacerlo correcto sería where, where both the read parts, donde fue comprado, ¿ok? No okay. estamos hablando, no estamos hablando donde lo compraste o quién lo compró, sino que donde fue comprado, ¿ok? What else? Okay. Not the number three. What was the price of the product? Three hundred dollar. Okay. Where? Okay. What was the price? What's, is that right? What's what the price? Okay. What was the price? What it was thirty dollars. Okay. What else? Uh, where, where, where in tally in the sewing machine? What was installed? ¿Qué fue instalado? What was installed? In the, in the in sewing the, machine. Okay, in the sewing machine. Okay, but as I said, here is another, uh, es otro tiempo que no lo hemos estado, no lo hemos visto todavía, que lo por, probablemente será en los próximos niveles, ¿ok? Que sería okay. el pasado participio, ¿ok? Where was installed, mm -hmm. where were both, ¿ok? Son otros tiempos, ¿ok? okay? And now we are trying to use just simple past. So el, el simple pasado. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. Um, let me see. Teacher, only two questions. Mm -hmm. Julio? Okay. Yeah. Uh, First question, uh, why, is, why is it said that customer service was great? Um, how, was, how was the customer service? Uh, sorry? How, como, how was the customer service? That is uh, the question. No, the, the, the pregunta is, uh, por qué? Se dice que eh, la atención al el servicio de atención al cliente era grandioso, great. Why is it said that customer service was great? Is mm -hmm. correct? Why was customer service great? Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, because we receive all the information we need. Okay, because we will yeah, see all the information. Cool. Yes, that okay. is one, one way. Yeah. Okay, the second question, where was the spark installed? Is correct? Um, in the seaweed machine. Correct. Is the answer. Correct. Thank you. Where was the deep part? Sport. Stop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. That is a correct uh, form to use simple pass, right? 
Okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, someone else who has a different uh questions, or if teacher, you have the same, just let me know. Hello, teacher. I have a question. Yes. Uh, what's the means of spare part? Spare part. Spare part. Okay. The spare part. Okay, let me see, in a machine. Okay, because as an adjective is different, but let me let me search the specific uh, definition in a machine, okay? Okay. okay. Okay, it is maintenance parts include items such as, okay, it says emergency spare parts. <clears throat> okay, yeah, are the maintenance parts, okay, like the extra parts that you need to have for a machine in case you need to give maintenance to that part, to that machine. Maintenance. Mm -hmm. okay. There are the spare parts. Thank you. Okay. What else, guys? Okay. So, uh, we already shared the answers. Yes, we already did that. Thank you so much for the ones that participated in the previous activity. So now, I have an exercise just to practice. Practice the verb Okay, make W equation with the B, uh, but or the past simple. Okay, complete the sentences. Past simple with uh, B was and were W H equation. Okay, how will be here the question? Why? <clears throat> Why? Where? 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 <laughs> the children. Who said the children? Okay. Mm -hmm. Why were the children upset? Okay. Where were you? Mm -hmm. Where were you? How was the weather? How? How was, How was the weather? How was the weather? The <clears throat> weather. Uh huh. Number four. When was, when was he, he at home? He at home. Okay, when was he at home? Okay. Why were, Why were they? they at the hospital? Hospital. Yeah. Okay. Why were they at the hospital? Mm -hmm. Number six. So long was the concert. Okay. Number seven. Why were you late? Why? Where? Where you late? You late? Okay, number eight. Where was your sister last summer? 
Where Summer. was your sister last summer? What was she afraid? She afraid of. Okay. Um. Afraid. When was? When was? He had the study. The study. Okay. Very good. Good practice. Check. Okay. The answer. All of them are correct. Very good. So look at them because you will create a conversation now, okay? Using this type of questions, okay? Using WH questions plus B and the complement, the member and the complement. Um, you are going to create a conversation with a partner Okay, imagine that you are uh, in a phone conversation. Okay, uh, ask questions to your partner. Okay, I made a mistake here. Partner, ask questions to your partner about what did she or he did last weekend. Okay. Um. Basically, the conversation will be about what did you do last weekend, okay? You can use did or you can use the verb be, okay? The main purpose is, the, is that, the use, that you use the verb be in past tense, okay? Where and was. Um, but if you want to use the verb did, it's okay to make the questions and to give an answer, you can use just no questions or information questions. If you use information questions, remember to use simple past like this. Hey, sorry, I missed your call. Okay, why? Uh, because if you give a positive, like a positive statements like this, and I missed your call means that you are not using the auxiliary, right? Just when you use the auxiliary like a question, you use the normal verb, okay? But if you are using uh, just as a positive statement, una oración positiva, so you use the verb in past. Do you have questions? Tienen preguntas, guys? about what you are going to do. Teacher. Yes. Um, the question is, what did she did last weekend? Mm -hmm. Or, or what did she do? I'm sorry. Yeah, you are right. Ooh. What did she do? Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Good observation. What did she do? Because here is the is the auxiliary. Uh -huh. This is the main verb. What did she or he do last weekend? Okay. Okay. Yes. Good. Very good. Okay, guys. Uh, yeah, that is a typical mistake that we that we can do. Right? You use did twice, the basis, right? But in this case, will be just the the first one, the auxiliary. What did she or he do last weekend? Okay, let me uh, break out the rooms. I will create. Um, voy a crear las pequeñas salas. You are going to work in pairs, okay? Let me see. If you have questions, I will be here. Just let me know. Okay. 
Let's see. Okay, lady, you will work with. Maria Leticia, are you available? O solo está como oyente? Maria Leticia? Solo como oyente, teacher. Okay. okay. Al final, este, me regala unos minutitos. Okay. Okay. Okay, lady, you will work with Mauricio. You are available, Mauricio? Yes, yes, teacher. Okay, good. Um, let me see number two. Julio, are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay, hey, Sal, are you available? <clears throat> yes. Okay, you and Julio. Okay, number three. Okay, Kathy, Briseida, are you available? Kathy? Yes, yes. Okay. Kathy and Robert. Robert, yes, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Gilberto, you will work with Rolando Danilo. Rolando, are you available? Yes, Rolando? teacher. Okay, good. Thank you. Salvador. Is, um, Silvia. Silvia, are you available? I don't know, Silvia. I guess uh, your microphone is not working okay. Try to log out. Salgase de la meeting y vuelve a entrar porque le escuchamos eh, bien raro. Ahora no, no sé si solo raro. soy yo. No, yo también la escuché. Yes. <risa> wow. Ok. Uh, no sé qué será, pero no es eco. No sé. Ok. El micrófono procedido. <risa> procedido. <risa> maybe, okay. maybe. Ok, Salvador Alberto en Wilber. Wilber, are you available? Yes. Yes, okay, good. You and Salvador. Okay, number six. Okay, Liliana, are you there? Liliana, Laura? Yes, yes. Okay, Liliana. Daniela, Lisette, are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay, you, Liliana, and Daniela. Okay. <laughs> Una vaca. Escriba. Está en mi pato. Gracias, el mu. Silvia, escríbame, escríbame, porque no, de verdad se escucha raro el, el audio. Ok. Uh, ok, let me see. Let me see. Oh, ok. Cindy, are you available? Yes, teacher, I'm right here. Okay, William Roque, are you available? O solo está como oyente. William. Excuse me, teacher, solo de oyente. Solo de oyente. No, no puede ahorita trabajar, no. Okay. Carla y Dari, are you available? No, también de oyente. Juliana Amaya. Juliana María. No, María Leticia dice que no, es como oyente, que okay, tengo entonces como cuatro oyentes y Silvia que no le funciona bien el micrófono. Ok, Silvia uh, puede la, de, salirse de la miren y volver a entrar para ver si se le arregla. Ok, esperemos Cindy, si no, si no puedo arreglarlo Cindy, la voy a pasar con Daniela y Liliana. Ok, si no, si Mari, si María Leti, digo, si Silvia Estela no puede arreglar su micrófono, la voy a dejar a usted con Daniela en Liliana, ok. Ok, but let me open the rooms now. If you have questions, please let me know, ok. Voy a abrir los rooms.
No, Silvia, no. No le funciona, Silvia. Se escucha como que fuera, no sé cómo decirle, un hombre bien ronco. <ríe> oh, no. Silvia, entonces solo quédese. Eh, usted puede escribir las oraciones en el chat, las preguntas que usted tenga para un compañero. ¿okay? Puede escribirlas en el chat y usted elige quién se las hace. And I will read it for you. Yo la voy a leer por usted. Okay, let me see. Okay. Um, Cindy, entonces la voy a enviar con Daniela y Liliana al uh, room number six. Cindy. Okay, teacher. Okay. Or, or weekend? Uh, weekend? Past weekend. Past weekend. Uh, uh, football game. Mm, okay. Uh, was your sister at home last night? Was. Was your sister at home last night? Oh, no, she wasn't. Okay. Were you asleep all night yesterday? Why? Why? Were you asleep all night yesterday? Oh, I didn't sleep. Uh, ¿Dónde dormiste anoche? ¿Eh? Como que si se desveló. <laughs> okay. Oh, sleep. okay. A sleepy in that case, lady. Were you a sleepy? A sleepy. Okay. Uh, si le pregunta okay. dónde, si le pregunta dónde durmió, sería where did you sleep? Pero si uh -huh. le pregunta si estaba como con este desvelado, soñoliento, where did where? Okay. Where you uh -huh. a sleepy? Were you sleepy last mm -hmm. night? Uh -huh. Ah, okay. ¿Dónde te desvelaste? Where, where you sleeping? Where you sleepy last night? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, okay. Try to try. Remember that will be a conversation, okay? Cuando cuando ustedes este ya estén listos, cuando ya estemos en el main room otra vez. Van a ser como uh -huh. una conversación. Entonces traten como de... Como ¿Ordenar? De ordenar las ideas. Ajá. Okay. Ah, ok. Sí, porque okay. primero le pregunté si había ido a ver a, a Barbie. <risa> ok. So you can, you can ask that question. Ajá. Uh -huh. And then you can... Is, uh, traten de hacer como la conversación fluida. Ok. Como que de, un, de una pregunta... Se puede ser que de esa pregunta dependa la otra pregunta. 
y así. Ah, como que si trabajó, ¿verdad? Y después como que si fue a ver la película o algo así. Yes. Ok. Ok. okay. Good job. See you. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. See you at, uh, let me see, 9.20. 25? 25. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, okay. Mauricio. Entonces, okay. primero le voy a preguntar. Sí. Because, because I had a race in the morning. Because I had a race in the morning. Um, at noon, I had a lunch with my family. And at noon, I had a lunch with my family. Y ahí yo le voy a preguntar, what did you do yesterday? Y usted me cuenta qué es lo que hizo ayer. Ok, solo que um, yo diría del, del sábado y del domingo, de ambos. Ah, todo, todo el sí, sí. Elige si habla del sábado y el domingo, porque como la pregunta es, what did you do last weekend? Ok. Um, o, o si trabajó el sábado, puede decir, um, last Saturday I worked all day. Um, yesterday. I I go I went out with my family or, or with my boyfriend or with my friends or Ahí sale, solo que hagamos algunos cambios ahí lo tenemos en el chat no sé vaya de acuerdo me parece okay Quiero agregar unos días más. Quiero ver. Okay, me parece que así está bien. ¿Te parece que lo dejamos así? ¿Cómo es para la sí. práctica? Ok, Correcto. solo estoy copiando. Y me dices que día usamos, porque ahí prácticamente están todos. Yo creo que todos participan. Bastante, o los dos participan bastante, ¿cómo se llama? Parejo, pues. Ajá. Vaya, perfecto. Si gustas, pues, ¿qué? ¿Podemos hacer práctica? Sí. Guys, sorry to interrupt. Try to, try to formulate or create equations, ¿ok? Porque no estoy viendo las preguntas aquí. Eh, try to, uh, traten de hacer las preguntas. Y sí, es también las ideas, pero traten de ser como la pregunta. Por ejemplo, uh, por, por ejemplo, la uno. Dice, person one, on Thursday, 
I had a dinner with my cousin. Okay. Podría ser. Oh. What did you do? Okay. What did you do? Yo les estaba okay. diciendo. Ajá. Yo les estaba diciendo que hablaran del, del, del fin de semana. Last weekend. Right. So lo pueden okay. cambiar ahí como por sábado. What did you do on Saturday? Okay. Uh, okay. okay, I had a I had a dinner with my cousin in your restaurant. We tried different dishes and everything was delicious. It's okay. Okay. Um Sunday. Pueden, pueden escribir como del domingo, okay? Was your Sunday quiet? Super tranquilo. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes, try to, traten de adaptarlo, ¿ok? Ok, entonces podemos tomar ya desde el viernes, ya viernes, el fin de semana. Dice. Ok. Ya casi. It's ok, okay. it's okay. But okay. Try, try to make equations, porque ese es el propósito, ¿ok? Que ustedes sí. eh, practiquen cómo hacer preguntas en pasado, utilizando... It's not only a conversation, yeah. Uh, preguntas, acuérdense que en una conversación hay preguntas, entonces sí, okay. pre hacen la, la pregunta, dan la respuesta, ok? Muy bien, ok, thank you. Ok, <coughs> see you. Uh, mm, quizás a las y treinta, ok? Muy bien, ok, okay. good. Va, empecémoslo si quiere, entonces. Eh, oh, I, I, I was. I was. Ok. In, son, eh, in, in Sunday. On Sunday. On Sunday, ajá, on Sunday. I was on Sunday. Uh, cooking for cooking. cooking for family. For family. Okay. Le cocinó a su familia. Sí. Eh, eh, no, no sé cómo. Ah, ah. Un, Fir, fer, fish, fish, eh, fray, ¿verdad? Pescado frito. Ah, ya, yeah. fish, fry, fry fish, creo que es algo así, creo. Yes, fry fish. Fry fish, o ¿verdad? Solo, solo... Yes, fry fish. Mm -hmm. Fry fish, ajá. Uh -huh. Fry fish. Teacher, I, I, I have a question. Yes. Uh, the uh, the use was uh, the verb is 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 in present. Present. Mm -hmm. Si usted está the... usando solo uh, simple pass, okay? Está usando el simple pass. Okay. Si utiliza el verbo to be. Solo sería was or were, ¿ok? Y puede utilizar también It's, el did y el yeah. verbo normal. Did, uh -huh. ajá, vaya, yo sé que cuando uso el did puedo usar el verbo normal, por ejemplo, y digo, I did work, este, pero si no lo usara tendría que usar el verbo eh, eh, work, ¿verdad? Word. Si no usara el did. Word. Uh -huh. Word, ajá. Y si uso el, el was que dijera I was work, lo usara en present simple o, o en pasado. Esa es la dudita que tenía. I was working. I that was is, working. That is uh, pre, past continuous. Ah, pasado, es, pasado continuo. Mm -hmm. Ah, o sea, the, the, o sea que usando el, el was tendría que usarlo en pasado continuo, working. Yes, I was working, estaba trabajando. Ah, uh -huh. uh, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Ajá, y usando el did no han necesitado decir working, no, no, no. no es preciso, no. No. Ah, ok. Just I worked. Ah. Trabajé. Ajá. Ah, ok, teacher. Ok. Y recuérdese, por ejemplo, si yo le pregunto, um, how was your Saturday? How was your Saturday? ¿Cómo estuvo su sábado? Ok. How was your Saturday? Ahí no estoy usando otro verbo, solo estoy usando el verbo be. Ese es como el verbo principal, ¿verdad? How was your Saturday? Le estoy preguntando cómo estuvo su sábado. ¿Cómo me daría una respuesta usted? Um, eh, I, I was I was Saturday is um, no, excuse me I, ¿Puedo contestar con el did? No, porque estoy no, usando solo, el verbo solo ah, solo el was ok, I was uh, Saturday is hard teacher ¿Es correcto? Ok, estamos hablando del sábado, cómo estuvo el sábado, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entonces podría utilizar como it, ok, esto, it. se refiere al sábado, it Ajá. was, it's Saturday. I slash. it was very hard, estuvo bien ah. duro, because, ahí puedo dar una razón, because I worked, porque trabajé. I worked. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, it's Saturday. It, it's Saturday. It was. Ah, uh, it was. Ah, uh, it was Saturday. Ya no mencioné el día porque usted, ah, dice, ya no. usted dice it se refiere a al sábado, día. Al ah, día. ok, ok. O puede decir it, también it, it was relaxed. It was, ajá. Uh -huh. It was relaxed because I went to the beach, for example. Ah, ok. Esa sería la respuesta correcta. Uh -huh. okay. ok, si yo, la, yo se, la, se la contestaba así usando el was, I was, no sé. <ríe> Sorry. También, también puede utilizar, uh, también puede, es válido, puede decir I was in my parents' house, ok, estaba en la casa de mis papás, yo estuve en la casa de mis papás, we cooked a lunch. Ok, uh, pero también puede decir it was con referencia del it sábado, was. del sábado. It was. Ajá, uh -huh. ya me estoy refiriendo con el it's, me estoy refiriendo al, ya el, al, al día, al tema. Al día, ah, al día okay. sábado. Correct. Ok, teacher. Ok. Ok, teacher, thank you. Ok. Ok, okay. Los, los veo pronto, porque ya voy a cerrar, ok. Ok, teacher. Good. Ok, gracias. Okay. Don Rolando, dígame. Don Rolando, usted me sí, puso diga. how about you last weekend, entonces. Vaya, buenísimo. Vaya, ahí la practicamos. Ok, we finished, teacher. Ok, good. Ya voy a um, close the rooms, ok? Los, voy, los veo en el main room. Okay, teacher. Okay. okay, teacher. Okay. How are they? Hi, Daniela. Very good. And you? No, no va. Va a responder después va Liliana. Después que ya le preguntó. Y ella que diga en you, porque entonces para que responda ella. Porque como somos dos, somos tres. Ah, en yo, Liliana, así. Ah, no. <ríe> bueno, yo le digo, how are they? Y usted me dice que está bien, va. Bueno, gracias. Uh -huh. Y de allí responde Liliana. Y ella me dice en you. Ah, ok. O sea que eso le voy a responder a usted. No, ni Ajá. Ni. Ah, ok, ok. Otra vez. <ríe> Otra vez.
I'm sorry, I was speaking in mute. In mute. Sorry about that. Okay, okay. Are you ready? Ready? Yes, teacher. I'm ready. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Very good. So we're going to use the wheels, the wheels of names. Okay. We have six rooms. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. Number one is Lady Joanna Mauricio. Um, Hazel, number two, Julio. Number three, Katy Briseida, Roberto. Number four, Gilberto and Rolando. Number five, Salvador and, and Wilbur. And number six, uh, Cindy, Daniela, and Liliana. Okay? Ready. Okay. Okay, um, Mauricio. Hello. Hi, Mauricio. Hi, okay. Lee. How are you? Sorry. <laughs> 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 lady, lady, se emocionada. Yo dije, ah, I'm going to use the Wilson's names. <laughs> okay, pero no estoy compartiendo, ¿verdad? No está bien. No, por eso, por eso fue como que, ok, hay que dar. <laughs> ok, déjenme compartir. Ok. Sorry, ah, hoy sorry. sí, hoy sí. Ok, pero lo voy a volver a hacer porque igual no estaban bien. But igual, si quieren ser volunteers, you can do it first. If you want to be volunteer lady, it's okay. You decide. Se decide. ¿Quieres ser voluntaria? Sí. Okay. So, Mauricio. Room number one, los, <laughs> los elimino de acá. Okay. <clears throat> Okay. Hi, Mauricio. Hi, lady. How are you? Fine. And you? Yeah, I'm just fine, too. Did you do the English homework? Uh, no, I didn't. Okay. I was, Did you? I was Sorry. working. I was working at 7 o'clock. Mm, I got it. Then did you go to see the Barbie movie? No, I didn't. I was very tired. Was your sister at home last night? No, she wasn't. She went to see the Barbie movie. Who did she go with? She went with her boyfriend. I understand. Did you stay up last night? Uh, yes, I stayed at home last night. Okay. Bye, Mauricio. See you soon. Okay. okay see you later, lady. Thank you. Okay. That was <laughs> very good. Lady, just can you please repeat the last question that you did? Uh, did you stay up last night? Did you stay at home last night? Uh, okay. Uh huh. At home. Okay. Okay. Then everything. Yeah. Repeat. Did you stay at home last night? Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Very good. That was good. Good job. 
Thank you so much. Another volunteer, if you want to be a volunteer, so you decide. Group number three, okay. teacher. Parenthesis, Hazel, uh, be to check, por fa. Thank you. Okay, number three, row number three. Yes. Okay, Kathy Embry say that. Okay. Go ahead. Kathy, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Hello, Kathy. How are you? Hello, Roberto. I am very good. What about you? Not bad. I am fine. What did you do last weekend? Okay, on Saturday, I worked all day. Yesterday, I go up early because I had a race and I was running 10 kilometers in the morning. Um, at noon, I have lunch with my family. In the afternoon, I take a nap. What did you do last weekend? Saturday, after leaving work, I went to see a movie with my sister. On Sunday, I went to the market and cleaning my house. In the afternoon, I watched series. Oh, that's right. Did you enjoy your last weekend? Yes, I did. It was amazing. Did you like your last weekend? Yes, I did. It was very nice. Thank you, Kathy, for sharing your experience. Thanks, you, Robert, for sharing too. Okay, that was really good. Okay, Robert, just remember uh, when you said uh, trabajar en pasado, work, 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 work. work. Mm -hmm. You said I take a nap, okay? Because you are to you are talking in past, you will say I took. Okay, I took a nap. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, very good. Good. Okay, um, Kathy, so cleaned. I cleaned, cleaned. I cleaned, cleaned. Cleaned. cleaned my house. Cleaned. And cleaned. I, I washed, I serious. washed, serious, mm -hmm. washed. Yes. Okay. Thank yes. You. You're welcome. Well, thank you so much, both of you. Very good job. Another yes. another volunteer? Want to be a volunteer? Uh, room five, teacher. Room five. Where is Salvador? Salvador. And? Wilbur. Wilbur. Salvador and Wilbur. Okay. Uh, are you ready, Salvador? Uh, Yes, ahorita mismo, permíteme un momentillo. Ahorita. <laughs> okay. Ready. Okay. Hi, Salvador. Did you buy the toner of the printer? Yes, I did, Wilbur. The price was 60. Okay, I need the approbation of the product. Of the new toner? That's right. It will be ready today. Great. Did you order it online? Yes, I ordered it online. How was friendly the web page? It was easy and quickly. Okay. That's it? That's it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Was friendly the web page? The web page. Was friendly the web page? 
Yes, it was, right? Okay, very good. Good job. Thank you so much, guys. It was good. Okay, uh, rule number, I don't know, if, if two, four, or six. Volunteers? Oh, quieren que gire la ruleta. Two is okay. Number two? Okay, where yes. is Hazel and Julio? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Hi, Julio, what did you do last weekend? Hi, Hazel. It was a very great weekend. Really? What did you do on Friday? I went out with uh, some friends to a karaoke bar. What about you? Well, I went to the movies with my husband. Did you go out on Saturday? No, I didn't. Uh, because I organized a barbecue in McBadger. Uh, that sounds great. Um, tell me, did you go to the church on Sunday? Yes, I did it. Uh, later, I just relaxed at home watching a series on TV. Uh, what did you do on Sunday? Well, I visited some relatives. And after that, I just take a time to relax at home. I think we had an awesome weekend. Okay. Oh, nice to perfect. Hey, sir. Nice to uh, talk with you. Great. Thank you, Julia. Okay. Thank you. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Organized. Okay, just repeat that. Organized. Organized. Mm -hmm. Organized. Organized. Yes. Yes. Thank that you. Is, that was the only one that you need to uh, double check. Okay. It was really good. Thank you so much. Okay, volunteers for room four or six. Don Rolando. Okay, okay, Don Gilberto. You are Ron four, right? Okay. okay. Yes. Hello, Mr. Gilberto. How are you? Hi, Mr. Rolando. What did you last weekend? Oh, I did work in my company. I was to start to working at uh, 8 a.m. How about you last oh. week? Oh, I did buy my claim in Plus Market on Saturday. I was on Sunday cooking for my family fried fish. Okay. Um... Thank you for your information, Mr. Gilberto. Bye bye. See you later. Bye. See you later, Don Rolando. Thank you so much. Okay, Gilberto. So the first question is Did you work last weekend? Is that correct? Uh, what did you last work? What Last did you week? do? What did, what did you, you do? do? Last, Last weekend. Last weekend. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. And also you mentioned I was on Sunday cooking. It is I was cooking on Sunday. Okay. Or, or I cooked. Okay, le quitamos el was cooking y solo le no, quedaría cooking. solo le quedaría el verbo en pasado. Cooked. I, wa I cooked lunch for my cooked. family on Sunday. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Yes. Remember when uh, we use just the the verb in past, okay, como una oración, nada más que no es pregunta, entonces no utilizamos el verbo to be, solo utilizamos el verbo en pasado, 
que en el caso de este sería cooked 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 cook uh -huh. cook verbo pasado cook. cocinado cook. yes yes okay good job guys thank you so much okay number uh six rule six Go ahead, guys, girls. Okay. Liliana, Cindy? Okay. Hi, Liliana. Hi, Cindy. How are they? Very good, Danny. And you, Liliana? I'm fine. Thanks, Mr. God. I'm glad to hear it. I am. I am really fine. What did you do last weekend? On the weekend, we went for a walk with my family. We went to eat Mexican food. We like tacos. What did you do last weekend, Liliana? I worked last weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Oh, that's bad. And you left late? That left my job at 11 o'clock tonight at night. What a tiring day. Cindy, um, what about you last weekend? Um, on the weekend, we went for a while with my family. We went to eat Mexican food. Oh, good, Cindy. Thank you, Daniel. Yeah. I went shopping at the supermarket. Really <laughs> Thank you, Pala. Daniela is in Sileva. A pleasure. Good night. Thank you, Ben. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, the first. The first uh, question is, how was your day, right? How was your day? Yes? No, no. What did? Ah, uh, how are they? How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo su día? Okay. No. What did you do last weekend? Or what did you do last weekend? Mm -hmm. okay. okay. What did you do last weekend? But I didn't hear the complete uh, sentence. Okay, but that is okay. Remember the, the verb in past, el verbo trabajar in, pa, en pasado, oh. no es work it. ¿Cómo dije que se, que se pronuncia? Work. Word. 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 Okay. Word. <clears throat> si estamos describiendo un día que decimos que fue cansado, Tired. Tired. Mm -hmm. Tired day. Ok. Un día cansado. No vamos a decir mm -hmm. tiring. Porque este es un, es un adjetivo. No es un verbo. Ok. Es un adjetivo. Tired. Mm -hmm. No se le puede poner ing. Porque, mm -hmm. porque no es verbo. Ok. Tired day. Tired. Uh -huh. Tired. Ok. Okay, well, thank you so much, everybody. Good job, that was really good, thank you. Okay, to move on, we're going to move on now to the homework. Vamos a moverlas a la tarea. La tarea 15. Y 
experiencia. Let me know when you are ready, please. Okay, Gilberto, ready? Are you ready? Yes, I was. Yes, I am. <clears throat> okay, good. Uh, how will be the first, the first answer? Was I late? I, yes, of course. I question. was late. Yes, yes, I was. Late. Yes, I was. Was. I was. Yes, I was. Okay, esa es una. Si es positiva, ¿verdad? Si es negativa, ¿cómo sería? No hay wasn't. No hay wasn't. No hay no no wasn't. No wasn't. Ok, vamos a dejar solo una. Ok. Were you in a school yesterday? Yes, I was. 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 I was. Ok. Remember, we did some of the, this uh, similar in uh, in the first activity. Okay, was he at work this morning? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. He was. Yes. Okay, was she tired? Yes, she, yes, she, was. she was. She was. Yes, she was. Okay, was the movie good? Yes, yes, it was. Yes. It was. It was. It was. It was. Okay. Good. Okay, look at them. All of them can be positive or can be negative. And they will be fine. The, those are the short answers, okay? Short answers to your equations. Okay, very good. Um, submit it, ok envíenlas vamos a revisar cómo van en sus notas porque ahorita las voy a pasar voy a pasar a a, a su a su scores que tenemos que entregar a su tablita de notas Okay, very good. Okay, we are here. Tendremos que estar terminando la sección 3, ¿ok? Tendría que ir 100, 100, 100, 100, 100 aquí. Muy bien por los que han avanzado en la sección 4, pero eso la vamos a iniciar mañana. Ok, eh, muy bien a los que a quienes terminaron el midterm. Aquí faltan algunos que no lo han hecho. Ok. Good. Aquí tendríamos que tener 100, 100, 100, ¿ok? Homework 1, 2, and 3, significa sección 1, sección 2, sección 3. Aquí tendríamos que llevar 100, 100, 100, 100, estos tres 100 y el 100 del meter. Ok, para los que no lo han, no lo han uh, terminado, please do it. Estamos bien acá. Ok. Good. Good job. Si tienen alguna duda, igual me pueden preguntar. Ok. Y yo les puedo ayudar a los que, a los que están menos de 100. Ok, guys. Uh, that will be everything for today. Solo me voy a quedar con. Um, Mi María. María Leticia. Ok. 
And then okay, everyone okay. can go. Good night, teacher. Have a good night, guys. Take care. Okay. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 You can disconnect, Silvia. Se puede desconectar. Si me escucha. Se puede desconectar, Silvia. No le escucho, no le entiendo nada. Solo eh, sí se puede desconectar. Ok. Eh, hey, ¿Quiere que... ¿Termine de grabar? Eh, o oh, no importa. No, no importa. Este, fíjese que yo solo le quería exponer que tengo a mi mamá ingresada y por eso no, no recibí la clase del viernes. Uh -huh. Pero me estoy turnando con mi hermana. Entonces, hoy he venido desvelada. Este, porque anoche me, me quedé an anoche y mañana voy de nuevo. Entonces, Creo que si, si me conecto mañana siempre estaría como oyente porque allá sí tengo más dificultad por la señal y por todo el ruido que se oye en el hospital porque hay unos monitores ahí que hacen mucha bulla porque este, ella se me ha enfermado de neumonía y entonces este, está en un cuarto donde hay más pacientes que están un poquito más graves que ella porque están conectados a máquinas. Uh -huh. Y, y a nosotros nos han permitido, o sea, hemos pedido permiso para estar ahí con ella, ¿verdad? Acompañándola, porque ella está bastante mayor. Entonces, este, eso le quería eh, que supiera usted que si me conecto voy a estar como... Como oyente. Oyente, ajá. Como oyente. Ok, okay. Sí. entiendo. Y lo siento mucho, espero que se mejore pronto. Primero Dios que sí. Porque desde el jueves la tenemos allá y, y, y pues nos da alegrones de que sí está bien, luego de que no, porque hoy nos habían dicho que le iban a poner hasta oxígeno porque ella tenía dificultad para, para uh -huh. respirar. Ajá. Okay. Pero entonces eso quería yo que supiera. <ríe> está bien, gracias por, por estar siempre pendiente. ¿Cómo no? <ríe> Ay, y una preguntita, yo vi que ahí tengo un... Un 84, me parece. ¿Será que alguna no contesté bien? <ríe> no tengo 100, 100, 100, sino que tengo 100, 100 y 84, 86, parece. Ok, déjeme ver. Uh, María Leticia. Mm, no, está bien. Está yo bien. bien. Yo la veo bien, quizás se confundió. Ah. Pero 100, 100, 100, 100, eh, va bien ahorita. Todo ah, bien. Va, está bien. <ríe> bueno, okay. solamente eso sería, teacher. Muchas gracias. Ok. okay Cuídese. Gracias. Buenas noches. Amén, igualmente. Buenas noches.